All right, time for a check on the weather. Meteorologist Josh Nichols is tracking your seven weather forecast. Josh, when are we going to see some sunshine? Oh, it's going to be a little <laughs> while. I think we're going to have to wait till probably sometime uh, maybe later Tuesday. But in the meantime, the cloud deck is stubborn, made it up to 37 for a top temp today after a low of 31. That's just about what you would come to expect for this time of year. As we head into uh, tonight again, we've got some misty light snow and as temperatures start to drop uh, under the 32 degree mark, we will find some slippery spots. So be careful on secondary, untreated and elevated road surfaces. Your Monday's mostly cloudy. We'll have a few flurries and then we'll get in on some partial clearing going into Tuesday, but still a chill to be added. So hour by hour we go here. You've got those temperatures that are right around the uh, freezing mark. Look at some of the numbers as we go through this week. We're looking ahead to temperatures that are pretty much very close to average or even just a little bit below average. So get used to the chill. It is with us and it is across most of the country uh, as well. You have to really head down to Texas or Florida for any true uh, relief from the cold. Satellite and radar as we look at our European computer model shows the next storm system that will be making its approach promises to get here later Wednesday night and Thursday with a combination of rain and wet snow. Right now misty cloudy here in Buffalo. We're at uh, 31 degrees. The breeze coming in out of the west at seven miles per hour. We go. We have those uh, pockets of fog to deal with as well right now. The visibility in Amherst at about five miles. Satellite radar here put together shows some of that misty light snow still coming down. So that is going to be the case as we go through uh, this uh, evening and overnight. And again, the clouds will be on the stubborn side as well. That breeze comes in out of the northeast. And those temperatures, again, dropping just below the freezing mark, means uh, those secondary untreated and elevated road surfaces, again, will be slippery. Tomorrow, we've got sunshine to look forward to. Uh, excuse me, rather Tuesday, I should say. We'll have some that uh, sunshine to look forward to. Going into Tuesday night, it's mainly clear. And we're talking about uh, temperatures taking a nosedive once again. Tonight, it's cloudy with a few flurries. The overnight low temperature, 28. Let's look at that uh, pinpoint map for numbers. Your top temp in Wilson for tomorrow at 32 or 28 for a for number in uh, <laughs> Akron. Things happen in the studio sometimes. Uh, 28, your high temperature in Clarence. 32 should do it in West Seneca. And as we go into tomorrow, we're looking at numbers here in the southern tier into the upper 20s. Have a check of that super seven day forecast. Again, we've got the clouds in place for tomorrow. Watch out for those slippery spots. Tuesday, we've got some sunshine, 35. Wednesday, clouds up again. Next storm system arrives towards the end of the week with a combination of rain and wet snow. Highs into the upper 30s, and it looks like uh, what could be a little bit messy again for the next Bills game on Saturday. And we'll be right back. Stay with us.